Hey guys, Footy Manager TV here. Welcome to episode number 28 of my Bath City Lower League Management playthrough in Football Manager 2015. And today is the huge game. I remember last year, FM15. I was in the same situation, but I lost it on penalties. I hope we don't suffer the same fate. We deserve to advance. Where do we go? We'll check out the league table this season. We'll check out competitions or go click here for Vanarama South. You can see we did finish second. We did finish on actually the same wins as Boramud, who obviously have got promoted. We scored the most goals in the league. We scored 93 and conceded 60. But Boramud, what a season defensively, though. Only conceding 37 goals at this level. Really, really good. They must have good some some good defenders there. Yeah? They must have some good defenders. Who did? Who's their main centre back? Who? Callum Reynolds. So he doesn't look too spectacular, but he played through the whole season. Played really well. I suppose he's got some decent mentals. He's pretty good. How about the other centre back? Who's the other highest valued centre back? At uh, left back, they got Matty Parsons. Again, he doesn't seem like any better than our players. It just, I guess, it's their team as a whole. They work together really well. There's Luke Gerrard. He's experienced player at this level, still being only 29 as well, but mentally, yeah, really, really good. But anyway, we shall move on. I really feel we, we are the team that deserves, but sometimes it doesn't go that way, does it? It's not always the team that deserves to get promoted. But yeah, you look at that, 74 points to 65. Uh, the goal difference as well, 33 to 5. We have to advance. I hope everything goes to plan here, and we do get the, we do get the chance to get into the Vanarama conference it'll be a great challenge for us and also I was looking you know how I talk about my save in FM14 I was looking back on the videos and what how it went like I signed so many quality youngsters uh with a few guys with Premier League potential a few guys with championship potential a few seasons in I hope I can do the same and have those same talents I'll be able to find them and all of that Whew. but yeah all the focus now is to win this game and of course, yeah, better players will want to come, of course, if we get promoted. So this is absolutely huge. So this will be the team I go in with. Uh, it's been, uh, it's a long decision. It's been a long decision for me. You got Ross Stern as well. I don't even know. The guys I've been playing, or the guys starting here, they had a very good previous games. You look at Nick Makuti. You go on form. Well, the previous game against Ebsleet, the last one he wasn't, but the two before that he scored. Uh, so it's a hard decision, isn't it? And then you've got JPS, who's been very, very consistent for us. He's been a quality player we signed this season. You go form. Uh, he scored in last game when he came on, actually, off the bench. And before that, didn't score in three games. And then you've got Ross. Oh, we have to start Ross, surely. Ross is going to have to come in, but hasn't scored for a while. Hmm. Well, in the last few games, well, yeah, haven't played. Yeah, two games he didn't play him, so he shouldn't count that. And before that, he scored six goals in two games. Now, we have to play Ross. Rossi, come in, mate. Uh, we'll drop Makuti, I feel, just because of his condition. Just because of his condition. But Noah Keats keep because, yeah, he's the false nine. And he's been playing amazing. Probably the best, along with Ross Stern. You can see the average of the last five games. Anyone who's not in the bench deserved, nah. There's no one. You've got Sakani Simpson. Like, I don't know. Rapson has been playing so well, but not like his average rating, not amazing. But in game, he looks like he's done well. Sakani Simpson, who's been good throughout the season, but he's not 100% fit. Nah, we have to go with the best player, Sakani. He's been really, really good this season. He's going down in training, of course, just come back from the injury, lacking match fitness, but he's the better player. And it's a big occasion. We need to get promoted. Charlie Ward as well. No, like there's the late changes I'm making here. Jim Rollo on the bench. He may come on late for Sakani. We'll see. And we'll go on with this lineup, I feel. Yes, this is the team. We've got Adelsbury on the bench. Lee Palmer. Oh, no, it's a big occasion for Lee Palmer. But he's got the talent. His talent has to show, you'd think. But I don't know. Adelsbury, he's done it before. He's done it before. We're going to go for Adelsbury. Put him central midfielder support and bring Frankie... Oh, wait, Frankie Artis, is he better as centre midfielder? Yeah, he's got a better rating. We'll leave him there. But, nah, come on. We want to attack here? Yes. Let's go in. Come on, lads. I know you can do it. We can get promoted here. We're favourites. We can do it. They're playing a defensive 4-5-1. They've got that Perry Ryan guy. I'm still scared of him. I know he's a quality player. He's going to have a lot of long shots. 
where I will show the positions. Again, we're applying all of that. We'll go through the team talk. We'll go f Leah Lamb again. He's got good motivation. And he does it again. And look at that Sakani Simpson. He's gone, well, not just now, from the team talk. I mean, yeah, from that day just going, when I selected the team just before, he's gone at one condition, like pre-match or something. So he's on the up and up. He's re he's recovering, which is a good thing. So, yeah, nice team talk there. It's good when you have a system manager that can just put in a good team talk. I might keep doing that from now. But Adelsbury needs to lift. Or oh, maybe early card, no. Got to be careful here, though. It's Stock. It's Beer with three E's. It's Ryan to Bub. No! Oh, how close! Whoa! We wouldn't go closer to going behind there. Couldn't have gone any close. Wow. Whew, we are lucky. Lucky there. Team talk. Let's say assertively. Oh, concentrate. Don't give away any stupid goals here. Come on. A goal here would be nice, but it's hard, of course. Could be going in half time. Nothing. Man. Maybe it's time for my team talk now. Just the manager. We'll go aggressive. I'm far from pleased. Oh, no. Pratt is demotivated. I'll just say assertively, there's a lot more to come from you. Doesn't fix it. But, yeah, a lot of the defensive-minded players got a good talk or got a good reaction from the talk. Simpson hoofs it forward, but nothing's going to... Oh, no. Galanar with a knock. That's not good. Simpson. Now, go, Stern. Put the pressure on. Oh, McLaren. No, it's Hooper. It's Hooper. Oh, I don't want to lose it. I don't want to lose it on the final day. Like, no, no, not again. I don't want to lose it again. Let's hold on. Come on. I don't want to experience that again. Like, we're so close to getting promoted in the first season. I have a good feeling about this season. I, or I've had a good feeling. Oh, no, it's a set piece. Locke takes it. Come on. This has to be a step forward from FM14. We have to get promoted. Pratt. Prats, no. What a golden chance for Pratt. We've got to make some changes here. Who's going to come on? Sakani Simpson, we'll take him off. We'll bring on Jim Rollo. Gallina, we're going to have to leave him on. He's the captain. And we don't have anyone else to come on as well. Adelsbury again has been poor. We'll bring on Lee Palmer. Stern or Prats. Leave it for now. Leave it for a bit later because it may go into extra time. I'll say I have faith in you. Lee Palmer, no pressure. And he's relaxed. Come on, we can do it. Just one goal. It's an even game here. One goal would do it. Let's see if this is for us, man. I'm so nervous right here. Like a goal either way could decide it. Shaughnessy, Donnelly, it's Ryan. Well defended Slocum. Now English, no, get rid of it. Now Stern. Yes, it could be our chance. Go, Pratt. He's been our superstar. Keats. No, Artis. Stern! <laughs> We're in the lead. 20th goal of the season. And he has got just the form at the right time. As we changed our tactics. He's hit the form. He's been smashing in the goals. And Ross Stern is the man. Artist with a class header. The smarts in him to pick up that assist. And we'll skip there. We'll make one more sub as well. Maybe just wait a bit longer. Because we might score a second here. We could kill it off. Pratt put it in. Palmer. Artis. Oh. That could have just made for sure. We would have got promoted. Oh, one more change. Come on, one more change here. Or should we go defend? But that's the thing. If we go defend, we would have took off one. No, we've got to keep attacking. Because then we'll have to sacrifice one. Like Noah Keats or something. Or should I do it? I'd... No, because we don't have a central midfielder to bring on. We can't anyway. Uh, we'll take off Pratt. We'll bring on Samuels with the pace. He'll be dangerous. Definitely. I just want to go for another goal to kill it off instead of just defending. He comes on looking happy. He's got killer pace for this level. Of course, at this level, there's a lot of slower defenders and everything. That's why he's been so good, I suppose. Or we can just hold on. Come on, finish it here. Stern! <laughs> oh! Oh, what? I thought he would have got it for sure. I was about to react to the goal, but it was saved by James Ruiz. 
Oh, we've got it. We just have to hold on for injury time. Yes. It's just the... F we've got it. We've got promotion. Palmer. Don't let him score. But it's over. Yes, we've got it. Oh, shit. Yes. Get in! Oh, my God. I sound really scary there, but... I don't, man. <laughs> we've got it. 1-0. Wow. I've had such bad luck with finals in recent times, like in my Man United save, losing in Champions League, losing in FA Cup, but we have advanced here. Yes, we deserve it as well after this season. Yeah, you're up. Come on, yes. Yes. We've got it. Exactly what I wanted. 1-0, gate performance. And what a man, Ross Stern, to win it for us. Who else? Killer season. Killer season. We're promoted. Yeah. Come on. None less than we deserve. We s they set the initial budgets as well. See, so getting promoted, we actually get some transfer budget here. But, like, really, I'm not going to be using it. You just go for free transfers at this level. So I just... I put it all there. So see how much wage budget we have. How much wage budget? Oh, shit! <laughs> we went from, like, having 100... And we're 2.7k. Oh, I'm licking my lips now. Oh, man. We can bring in so much. I'm pumped right now. Oh, man. I don't even know. See, unexpected promotion as well. I lead Bath to promotion. Alam, that's, of course, this is manager. You're planning for the future. So I guess I'll leave it at that. I'll, yeah, finish off the season. While the season is finished off, I'll just play it out and I'll do the signings and as usual uh you'll see the next season you'll see my signings and we'll see yeah we'll see how we're looking uh, we've got a good budget as well very good pro yeah very good profit this season 102k obviously the fa cup was a big part of that but getting promoted as well we got money in 94k now we're looking good we've got um, oh, we've got so much money in the budget now the board have the board have given to us uh, something we deserve after a good season and we can continue to hopefully bring in some talents but again, that all remains to be seen. Uh, maybe leave, what kind of players do you think I need? Like positions. Where do I need to reinforce with that money? We'll sort it out properly here. Don't worry about the contracts. And also, yeah, the contracts. We'll be letting go of a few now as well. So the offering of Frankie Artis doesn't matter anymore that he's on 500. It's not that much. But yeah, we'll be letting go of Hunt. He's on 130 per week. Uh, Jim Rollo, 70 per week. Uh, Chris Allen, 250 per week. Uh, Junior English, who'll just be going back from being on loan. And yeah, that'll be it. So a bit of extra. So that will push us to like 3K. We're going to have 3K. So that's amazing. We're going to have 3K to offer to players. And we're promoted. Everything's happening. So just at a quick glance. Goalkeeper, we won't have to worry. We've got Simon Locke. We've got that youth guy we'll bring in uh, to cover after Matt Hooten will go, go, go back from on loan. So you've got our defense. Maybe like a really good center back, I feel. Because Galinar's getting older. We've got to improve the quality of the team. We've got Dan Ball and Slocum. We'll keep the faith in those two guys. Probably another defensive midfield type to cover for Junior English, especially as Ben Adelsbury hasn't really performed. I'm disappointed in him. He's got potential, so he may he may improve. So you've got to keep the faith in him. So yeah, maybe another central midfield, especially as yeah, English, Jonathan Hunt, Chris Allen. He just he wasn't good enough for me this season. So he'll be going. He's a decent passer, but like I said, just wasn't good enough. So let those go. Lee Palmer, again, he's still a youth player. So definitely maybe a couple central midfielders uh, just to beef that up a little bit, especially yeah, Jordan Sherman will be going back. And strikers, maybe one beastly striker, but we've got all strikers for the next season. We've got Noah, yeah, Noah Keats is contracted. Uh, JPS is contracted. They're all guys that's going to improve, apart from David Pratt, I suppose. Had a great goal-scoring season in the first half of the season anyway. Chas Hemmings, I might even think to let him go. Even though we did offer him a contract, we can just release him. Like, if he just go to release on a free, it's still 13K. I don't know. I don't know what you think I should do. But he could still be useful because you know he's dangerous in the air. And Nick McCoody, we, just, we might as well keep him because he's on a non-contract. So... Anyway, we'll leave it for there. Um, leave your thoughts, what positions I need to focus on signing. Drop a like for getting promoted. We are in the Vanarama Conference next season. And I'll see you guys next time.